wounded in two different shootings at a suburban bowling alley. Glenn Marshall is live in Dalton with the details. Glenn. Hey, good morning. Now, we do know that at least one of those victims is in critical condition at the hospital right now after being shot. We also found out that the shooting happened around 8 p.m. and then around 11 p.m. Another shooting took place at the same bowling alley. You can see from the video that we have all of the shell casings that were on the ground. We counted at least 20 different markers on the ground at the time of the shooting. Well, at the time of the video was being recorded, Dalton police told us the shooting happened just before 8 p.m. at the Dalton Bowl bowling alley located near the corner of Sibley Boulevard in Dorchester. Avenue. Police said the bowling alley was rented out for a private party when some sort of altercation took place outside of the facility. A car drove by shooting at another vehicle. That's when a 52-year-old man was shot. He was taken to the hospital in critical condition. Now, while police were on the scene speaking to witnesses, and another shooting happened behind the bowling alley. This time, two other victims were shot. We do know one of them suffered non-life-threatening injuries. Dalton police say multiple agencies are working this case as they try to figure out the motive behind the shootings. This is an isolated incident here at the Dalton Bowling Alley. There's no random person on the loose going throughout our neighborhoods. We know exactly who we're looking for, and we have some combined efforts of the sheriff, the state police, and other agencies that are involved, and they're uh, rolling around right now looking for that particular suspect. But so far, no one has been arrested in this shooting, but police are looking for a vehicle, a silver or green Chrysler. If you know anything that could lead to an arrest in this shooting, they're asking you to contact them immediately. For now, we're live in Dalton on Glenn Marshall, WGN News.